channel I am finally back with another video I honestly did not know where I was going with this look I just you know went along with it I knew I wanted the lips black because I've never done it black before and since it's almost Halloween and everyone's doing Halloween looks I just thought you know let's just try something new so I just went with the black lips this eye look was actually very easy to do I think anyone can do it and I just wanted to add pink highlight pretty much all over my face so I hope you guys oh I have something in my eye so I hope you guys like this look if you do please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up before you leave and if you guys want to see how I got this look please keep on watching all right guys so I just did this eye just to see how it look because I haven't done an eyeshadow like this where it's darker from the inner corner and not from the outer corner so let's see how the whole look turns out so first I'm going to apply the elf cosmetics lifting concealer to prime my whole eyelid and I'm taking that all the way up to my brow bone so I can clean up my eyebrows. And first I'm going to take the Real Techniques Detailer Brush to clean the eyebrows. And then I'm going to take my finger and blend the whole eyelid. And then taking the Elf Cosmetics Translucent Powder and any blending brush, I'm going to set everything. And the palette that I'll be using is the Morphe 35N palette. I'm going to be using three eyeshadows. I'm going to start off using this brown one right here. I'm going to put that all over my crease. And I'm going to be bringing it down just a little bit to my eyelid. And then using the other side of the brush, I'm going to go into this dark brown shadow right here. And I'm going to just tap that on my inner corner. And then I'm going to go to the other side of the brush and blend that out. Now that I have that, I'm going back to the palette and taking this very light peach eyeshadow and put that on my outer corner. And then using the same brush from before without putting any more product on it, I'm just going to blend those two together. And now for my eyebrow highlight and my inner corner highlight, I'm going to be using the Davina Cosmetics Marina Eyeshadow, or eyeshadow, highlighter. This is a very beautiful pink shade highlighter, and I'm applying that with a B Bella brush. And then for my inner corner, I'm using the Real Techniques Detailer brush. And the eyelashes that I'm wearing are the Vegas Nay Grand Glamour ugh, Grand Glamour Lashes. You guys have no idea how many times I've used these eyelashes and they are still in good condition. And now moving on to my face, I'm just applying the Maybelline Cover Stick Corrector Concealer to all my red spots. And for foundation, I'm using the Elf Cosmetics Foundation Serum. This one's in a shade light, or sorry, light medium. And I'm just blending that out with a Morphe MB8 brush. For concealer, I'm going to use the Morphe 15 CON, or 15 Concealer. Is that what it stands for? Hmm. I'm going to use this shade right here. And then I'm going to use one of these sponges from Target, spray with a, the Elf Cosmetics ma Makeup and uh, Makeup Mist and Set. And I'm going to set my under eyes with the Elf Cosmetics Loose Powder and Sheer. And while that is setting, I'm going to contour my face with the Anastasia Light to Medium Contour Kit. And I'm applying that with the Morphe R8 Contouring Brush. And I don't like leaving this under here for a long time, so I'm just going to take that off before I continue. And I won't be applying blush today. I'm going to go straight into my highlight. I'm going to use the same Davina Cosmetics Marina Highlighter. I'm going to apply that with the Elf Cosmetics Fan Brush. For my lips, I'm going to start off by applying the e.l.f. Cosmetics Lip Exfoliator. I recently started using this one and I love it because it makes my lips feel very soft and the lipstick goes on very smooth. So I just apply it on, uh, apply it on and then remove it. Okay, the black lipstick I'm wearing is the e.l.f. Cosmetics Blackout Lipstick. This is my first time applying black lipstick so I'm kind of nervous on how this look is going to turn out. Let's hope it looks good. Okay. 
Okay, so this is a finished look. I don't want to do anything to my lower lashes because I don't want it to be that intense. And I liked how it turned out, so I just left it like that. So I really hope you guys liked this look and enjoyed this video. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I'll leave all my social medias down below if you guys want to check them out. I love you guys, and I will see you guys on my next video. Bye. And first, I'm going to take the... And it's going to be this... And now for my eyebrow highlight, it, and I like how, so I really hope you guys like this look.